G'day, we're down at Occupy Sydney where we've been having free school, which is basically a place where people can put down to, to teach or run a workshop or something like that. And we've been doing some interesting things today. One of the things I was involved in was sharing some ideas about a not-for-profit world economy. And there's some exciting stuff that's happening around the world in terms of not-for-profit activities, co-ops, worker co-ops, etc. But I think one of the fundamental things that we were exploring in the group as the basis for that is the misunderstanding and perhaps uh, the, the lack of attention that gets given to the difference between not-for-profit and for-profit. So most people, for example, would, in my understanding, uh, think of not-for-profit and think no profit. But in fact, not-for-profits uh, are quite entitled around the world to make profit. The difference uh, between not-for-profits and for-profits is what they actually do with the profit. For-profits will distribute that to directors or shareholders, equity holders, whereas not-for-profit will distribute that back into the organisation's work, out to charities, other groups, etc. That understanding between the difference between not-for-profit and for-profit and the understanding that comes with not-for-profit social enterprise uh, really, I think, lays the groundwork for different economic futures, for us to consider things that transcend left and right differences, etc. And when you lay that on top of the groundwork of the internet age, the digital era, where in fact not-for-profits now can actually uh, put themselves out there into the service provision space on a more level playing field in some respects with respects to for-profits because administration budgets, marketing budgets have come down, etc. You actually start to see a glimpse how there is already evolving a not-for-profit world in which every business has as its primary motivation the fulfillment of social needs, be that local, individual or community. So that's a really exciting thing we're exploring here. We then talked about uh, the share market and how that fits in there, how you would actually move, transition over a period of say 40, 50 years to a not-for-profit world economy. Some great discussions here and really looking forward to the rest of the day.